I think a lot of us are still under shock with James Curley and what happened to him this past Saturday night. Ashita, do I have you on the line right now? Are you guys as about as surprised as uh, the rest of the world is on your guys' stoppage over James Curley? Power of James Kirtland? Yeah, he spent a lot of time. A lot of uh, good fighters like uh, Peter Kitchapai quitting and uh, Alfred Pedro Angulo. Then uh, all the fighters had a lot of power, so he get used to it. That's fighting. Not so really. Not fear to be part of fight. I mean, it's okay, no problem. Um, did you guys do anything different in this fight to, to work on your power? Yes. Uh, before he fought, on a, he fought a Japan, right? Then uh, mm-hmm. uh, just like he. He fought kind of defensible before, but he he fought the United States. I mean, nobody knows him. Then Trader that that means me and Rudy Hernandez uh, uh, told him, hey, you have to fight, you have to fight, it. you know, because nobody him, nobody know him. So he just go like kind of offensive right now. Mexico, yeah, he, 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 yeah, he he ran the last fight in a Mexico fight uh, last October. Yeah, uh, okay. Diego Alvarez. Uh, Canelo's big brother. Yeah, he thought that he win the fight, but um, you know, this, not, he lost the uh, decision. Uh, the split decision or something. Yeah, that kind of he he didn't feel the like, confident decision, but he already know he okay because uh, Mexico, Mexico fighter fighter Mexico, so Mexico likes Mexico fighter. People like cheering the Mexico, so that's why he changed his uh, boxing style this time. You kind of have to fight out of your style. You have to fight in more of a power style rather than a technical style. Yeah, he likes technical style. Also, he he has a good ability to box. Like he know how to box, good skill. But uh, I'm talking about he's kind of you know defensive defensive fighter before. But this time, uh, we insist fight. You have to fight more aggressive fight. That's why he go fight. They keep setting the things because if behind the he if stay behind the road, I think. Uh, James Cracker and comfortable. But if he doesn't stay and keep the rings, I think uh, James Cracker is uncomfortable because he's not uh, more confident. At the weigh-in, uh, I was told that Kirkland was 40 minutes late to the weigh-in. Uh, somebody told me that he had spent most of that time in the sauna. Did you as a trainer notice anything about him, or were you aware that he was the one holding up the weigh-in? Oh, I don't know that uh, he... He, he was late, 40 minutes late. Oh, I don't know that. But I thought a bit, I thought a Kakran, Kakran is staying on his, he went to the jail maybe a couple of years. So I think, yes. I thought a Kakran makes hard to make a weight. Because they thought if I 160 something, then uh, two weeks ago, I mean three weeks ago, he fought at 160, one, over 160. Then this fight at 158. So I thought a uh, Kakran had to make a weight. Then hmm. the fight night, Fight time, you see that at one six eight, Kaka one seventy one seventy three. So all he he had it. He he had, I think he he's a, you know he's gonna kinda of be. But big means like he's heavy. So I, I thought always oh, I can I think Kaka had had to make a weight. That's why he weighed. I d I don't know this. What was the game game plan from the beginning and did it change after seeing him in Wagon? Did you guys change the game plan? Uh no, no, still thing. Because we can prepare for a fight. Anything happen. Nothing changed. How surprised was Ashida when he had dropped him with the left hand? Oh, oh he, he was surprised. Because in a, in a hard punch, I mean, they kind of tell. So, you know, he, he, he surprised. He punches, they kind of hit the team, right? So, I think Kakran, I, I know Kakran is like not a good team. Kakran has not a good team. Because he, he dropped around a couple of times and then he won with the last fight, you know. So if he hits a punch, I think Kakran is going to get down. So I expect that he hits a sting. I, I, uh, if he hits a sting, I think he does. He does. I expect already. 
So when he sees him drop, when Ishida uh, saw that he got dropped with a punch that was not that hard, like he just stated right now, then did that tell him to put a little bit more pressure and to continue to to trade with Kirtland? <laughs> Yeah, after he dropped, he thought, oh, uh, he's gonna, he's not think he thought I finish a fast round knockout. Because we turn into the, like, straight punches, like, right, right, right hand, right hand, right hand, right hand, right hand punch, jump, jump, right hand punch, only straight punches, because you see that taller than him, uh, taller than Kakan, so, uh, he thinks he go finish up in the first round. That's why I say, oh, you have to fight, fight, you have to finish, we have to knock him out this round. After, <laughs> but he told me, Kakan is like, the, he covered very soon, like uh, Felix funny that he dropped, but he get up soon. So he, uh, he's like, out there, he covered it very, but he thinks he's uh, careful to cut a punch. Anyway, he hit a, a lot of punch, so he come out. I don't know if this is necessarily true, but there's been rumors of possibly Sergio Martinez may be the, uh, you guys may be an opponent for him, for the uh, middleweight king. Yeah, hold on. That is, that is yeah, if Sergio Martinez wants to fight Ishida, or he say, oh, welcome to fight it. I'm glad to fight in Sergio uh, Martinez. He's kind of big name. Then more, of course, more fight money than, you know, he wants to fight with anybody. And then he, he fight uh, any little fighter uh, in the United States. He has, I know, he he thinks he know already that uh, he know he has a lot of sex defeat, but he confident it because this Ishida is like kind of everything across fight. Yeah, if Sergio Martinez wants to fight Ishida, uh, he say, oh, welcome to fight it. I'm glad to fight in uh, Sergio Martinez. Execution, 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 up for amateur, for amateur, amateur. Execution up for amateur. Who dares to challenge a clan's man holding a sword like Excalibur? No one on this earth can hold me. No one on this earth.